All right, let me ask you about this. Microsoft is fed up with people choosing bad passwords. The company has compiled a list of passwords you won't be able to use. The list is based off the millions of passwords that have been leaked over the years and will be continuously updated. So, what is, Pete, the best way to create a password? Oh, the best way to create a password is actually, um, is, is you know, the, the, these algorithms will put in like, dollar signs and stars and mix things up. Mm -hmm. That's actually not it because those are very hard for computers to guess, but they're very hard for us to memorize. And they're actually not as hard for computers to guess as you might think. Really? But the best thing to do is to take two fairly long, completely unrelated words, uh, like say, a uh, reindeer chair okay. or something uh, ridiculous like that. Right. And because that, a computer has a very hard time thinking those two words would even ever go together. It would never guess it. But I'm sure even after this broadcast, you might actually remember uh, that yeah, the, the password I just told you. Reindeer they're they're easier because it's a weird thing in your head. Why am I thinking of a so reindeer? So the algorithms oh, right, won't that's my password. know that. The algorithms, exactly. they won't pick up on that. I mean, right? the ones where, you know, the password manager suggests with the characters and the numbers, those are okay. Those are stronger than putting password. <laughs> <laughs> password one, two, three. Um, so if you're doing that, there's nothing wrong with that. It's just um, if you want things you can actually remember, um, that sort of idea of putting unrelated words, and you can do three or four, and, or for whole phrases, of course, um, just as long as there's a certain uh, unpredictability to it. And uh, that's, that's really the best kind of password.